the journey of something that is emerging and starting and forming now. Whereas most luxury fashion houses are trading on their heritage and the journey's already happened, you're just buying into it. Typically, if you look at one of my garments, there's no side seams, so it's this piece of cloth is wrapped around the body in the round. What would be otherwise waste becomes part of the garment feature. In early practice, I was very conscious of benchmarking myself against the practitioners I thought were avant-garde and leading in their field. But now I'm very confident in the iconic and standalone language that I've created. The garments are really thought about more as sort of compositions in space than they are thought about as clothes. The experience of being immersed in them is probably actually more important than the experience of being looked at. When I started my own practice, one of my highlights was seeing Shelley come through my door. I knew of her as a choreographer and a dancer and I'd been aware of her work for well over 15 years. when I did commission Shelley to enact the choreography of my wardrobe, we decided we wanted to try and overlay our two languages. The very basic template for the material byproduct show, it's a um, single model who's dressed and undressed in front of an audience in the round, typically in the workroom. I'm getting increasing pleasure out of work that is quiet and gentle. Shelley's work does what my work also does, which it creates a new beauty through the integrity of investing, building and practising one's own language. The new beauty that's emerging with the women that I deal with, it's summarised as not girl, not teenager, not young woman, but woman. So I'm not seeing fading beauty, I'm seeing actually a vibrant beauty, fit, healthy, socially, culturally active woman who is sure of herself and who doesn't need external validation. Not only am I trying to attract this sort of woman to my practice, I'm also trying to create this sort of woman for other women to imagine themselves into. I hope through working with Shelley, be able to draw more women out like this because there's just not many of them in the public eye. Fresh and genuine is avant-garde to me, particularly at a time when there is so much that we can look at all every time of the day and night. It's, it's actually much harder to get to a place that's quiet and it's quietly secure and confident in its own outlook. Mm -hmm.